After a slow start, LSU baseball roared back with one of their most complete games of the season against in-state rival UNO, defeating the Privateers 6-3 on Tuesday night at Alex Box Stadium. The Fighting Tiger bullpen has had a shaky start to the season, and with many questions surrounding their staff, they answered them with one of their best performances so far. You know, for me, it was almost like a, a little bit of a, a redemption game for a lot of those guys, and I'm, I'm super proud of them. You know, I, they all have talent. They've all been punched in the gut a little bit and uh, really responded to me. And, uh, you know, when I put my head on the pillow tonight, that's what I'm going to think about. And super happy for those guys because they're all good kids. They're all hard workers. They have ability. They've been through it a little bit, but they really performed tonight. With struggles offensively being common this season for the Tigers, it wasn't surprising to see them get off to a slow start on Tuesday night. Coach Johnson sees two main factors behind the funk the Stripes have found themselves in. Self-control and confidence is the whole deal. And, um, you know, we just we got to fight our way through it. And, um, you know, as coach, I'm going to be incredibly positive, you know, with the team, uh, communicate with them well, uh, be very consistent, you know, keep it about baseball and play and uh, try to help them through it, you know, because, you know, nobody's going to feel sorry for us. After some hard-fought SEC losses and another midweek victory Tuesday night, the Fighting Tigers believe they're on the verge of figuring it all out. Yeah, we're so close. We're, we're a pitch away, you know, a, a taking the dirt away. You know, it, we're, we're, we're right in every game. I mean, we're, this team's so talented. I, I'm excited for what we're going to do in the next couple weeks for sure. The Purple and Gold will need to get off to a faster start this weekend when they travel to Missouri to continue SEC play in a battle of the Tigers. Reporting for all things Tiger TV Sports, I'm Dylan Machashik.